therapy organization was needed on account of the multilingual nature and other differences. In 1948, the government appointed Allahabad High Court Judge S. K. Dhar to head a commission to look into reorganizing states on a linguistic basis. The commission, however, recommended reorganization on the basis of administrative convenience. The JVP Committee of Jawaharlal Nehru, Vallabhbhai Patel, and Patabhi Sitaramaiah submitted their report on the matter in April 1949. Even this panel rejected the idea of reorganizing states on a linguistic basis but said the issue could be looked at. In 1953, the government was forced to separate Telugu speaking areas from the states of Madras after a prolonged agitation by Telugu speaking residents. The death of Poti Sramulu after 56 day hunger strike ensured that the matter couldn't be ignored any more. This led to the birth of the first linguistic state of Andhra for Telugu speaking people. Similar demands for creation of states on linguistic basis followed thereafter from other parts of the country. The Fazl Ali Commission submitted its report on the issue in 1955. It suggested the country be divided into 16 states and 3 centrally administered areas. Under the States Reorganization Act passed in November 1956, the government divided the country into 14 states and 6 union territories. These states were Andhra Pradesh, Assam, Bihar, Bombay, Jammu and Kashmir, Kerala, Madhya Pradesh, Madras, Mysore, Odisha, Punjab, Rajasthan, Uttar Pradesh and West Bengal. The 6 union territories were Andaman and Nicobar Islands. Delhi, Himachal Pradesh, Lakhdiv, Minicoy and Amin Devi Islands, Manipur and Tripura. In 1960, the state of Bombay was bifurcated into Gujarat and Maharashtra after days of violence and agitation. Next came Nagaland in 1963 for Nagas. Chandranagor, Mahe, Yemen and Kerikal freed from France and Goa, Daman and Diu from the Portuguese were made into union territories or joined the neighboring states. In April 1966, the Punjab Reorganization Act was passed. This gave Haryana the Punjabi speaking areas while hilly areas went to the union territory of Himachal Pradesh. Chandigarh was made a union territory to serve as joint capital of Punjab and Haryana. In 1969 and in 1971 Meghalaya and Himachal Pradesh came into existence. Union territories of Tripura and Manipur were next converted into states bringing their number to 21. Thereafter Sikkim in 1975 and Mizoram Arunachal Pradesh in February 1987 also acquired the status of states. In May 1987 Goa became the 25th state while Jharkhand, Chhattisgarh and Uttaranchal were formed in November 2000. On June 2, 2014, Telangana officially became the 29th state. And in the past there have been instances when new states have been created, new union territories have been created, portion of a state has been merged with the other states and this is a regular exercise which parliament has been doing.